Introduced into the RAAF in 1978, the Lockheed P-3C Orion's main roles are surveillance, anti-submarine warfare, anti-shipping warfare and intelligence collection. Right now, every day of every week, one of these aircraft is on patrol around the Australian coastline and somewhere in the world. The P3 really is the sports car of the larger aircraft uh, with 20,000 sharp horsepower and uh, less than a 60 tonne aircraft. Only 20 people on board, you've got uh, a lot of excess performance. Eight or nine hours is a typical sortie length for the Orion with surveillance sorties lasting between 10 and 12 hours. On longer sorties, an extra pilot and flight engineer are often used due to the demanding nature of the flying. The tactical coordinator, or TACO, receives information from other stations on the aircraft, making any tactical decisions and sending relevant details to the pilots via the onboard computer system so the aircraft can be best positioned for tracking or attacking contacts. During the mission, the navigator is responsible for monitoring the aircraft's position, tactical communications, as well as contact and situation reports to mainland stations. The acoustic stations process information from sonar buoys deployed during a mission to gather data on submarines and other targets. Controlled from sensor station 3 are the radar, infrared and electronic warfare operations. Individual crew members work together to form a close-knit team, ensuring the high-tech capabilities of the Orion are used effectively to protect Australia's interests. Crew Taco, this will be a harpoon attack, one harpoon selected on station 10. Target is a uh, hostile destroyer and Trevor 1. 